Hello fellow teachers, good afternoon once again. As we continue the third part of our learning delivery modality scores for teachers, we are now going to focus on the third part which is assessing the LR materials. Now you are familiar with the LR portals and the resources that are available for you and your learners. While the resources may have undergone a quality assurance process, you may still need to assess the LRs in terms of their relevance to your lessons and to your learners. In this module, you will be introduced to some steps that you can take to ensure the relevance and usefulness of each LR as well as other issues that can come with the learning resource. By the end of this lesson, you will be able to first assess the quality of the LR materials from both DepEd and non-DepEd portals using the LR Rapid Assessment Tool. Second, discuss the insights and realizations about these LRs. And third, select and improve quality assured LRs that are appropriate for your teaching learning needs. For this lesson, our key topics or concepts would be learning resources, LR assessment tool, and quality assurance. Meanwhile, the resources that we need are the LR rapid assessment tool and the study notebook. At this point, may I please request you to study the LR Rapid Assessment Tool. Download an LR from either DepEd Commons or LRMDS portal and assess the material using the tool. Answer the following questions in your study notebook. First, was the material able to meet all the requirements? Second, were there any questions in the assessment tool where you answered no or cannot be determined. What decision will you make on the LR material and why? Third, are there aspects of the material not covered by the tool but still need to be assessed? Specify which aspect or aspects. And fourth, how does this exercise help you in picking the right and appropriate LRs for your lesson and your learners? So here's the Rapid Assessment of Learning Resources tool with seven criteria to answer. This include the following. First, is the LR material connected and relevant to the MELCs? Second, is the LR material appropriate to the grade level and the learner characteristics in terms of language, activities? Third, is the LR material easy to reproduce? And or disseminate. Fourth, is the LR material from a credible source or author? Fifth, is the LR material culture and gender fair? Sixth, is the LR material free from red flags on possible copyright and plagiarism issues? And seventh, is the LR material, the layout and format, easy to read and pleasing to the eyes? So all you just have to do is to check whether your answer would be yes or no or cannot be determined. After you have done with the first activity, explore other non-DepEd LR portals or platforms that you can find online. So this will be your second activity after the first. Take note of the portals in your study notebook. Download at least one LR from each portal. Then assess the materials using the same tool and answer the following questions in your study notebook. First, based on the assessment tool, how does the material from a non-DepEd portal compare with the LR from the DepEd portal? Second, based on the results of the assessment tool, what improvements do the materials, both from DepEd and non-DepEd portals, still need? And third, how does this exercise help you in picking the right and appropriate LRs for your lesson and your learners? Once you're done with the second activity, proceed with the third. Here's what you're going to do. Choose one of the LR materials that you have developed. Assess this material using the same tool. Then answer the following questions in your study notebook. First, how does your material compare with the ones that are obtained from the online portals? 
Second, what improvements do you still need to make in your developed material? Don't worry, you will be given enough time to answer those activities. The sharing and discussion of your answers to those questions will be done in the next LAC session. Just don't forget to jot down insights and information that can be useful to you in choosing the appropriate LRs. Also, do not forget to submit your LR assessments with your reflection on the exercises to your LAC leader. Ensure that you keep a copy for yourself.